morning, Toastmasters. Good morning. Thank you, Master Lord. Greg, thank you for stepping up because if you had not done that, I would be would have been standing up here. So I guess I'm up here anyways. <laughs> I really appreciate that you took this opportunity to tell us about something that we all need to know about because I don't think many of us knew very much about the VP of Education position. I think that was a smart choice on your part. The three roles that you told us about for the VP of Education was to schedule, to do the educational awards, and to plan speech contests. I didn't know that. Those were the roles, so that was good. I thought that your presentation was very informative, of course. You have a very confident air about you, and that really shows when you speak. And I liked that you were able to include the audience. I thought that your PowerPoint presentation was well organized, it was well planned, you knew what was on the screen, you didn't look at it, and you didn't have too many words on the screen, and that's sometimes pretty hard when you're doing a, a PowerPoint. not a PowerPoint, that's not okay. what I'm looking for. An educational PowerPoint. Like an informational, there we go. Informational PowerPoint. I also thought that you were very responsive to the questions during your, your Q and A section se session of your speech. You were able to listen and respond appropriately to everyone's questions. I feel like sometimes a speaker doesn't really listen to the full question and just starts answering it before the person's done the asking it, but you did a good job listening to suggestions. Now I'm waiting for the green light. <laughs> um, you could have used the room a little bit better, but since you had the presentation, it's kind of a little bit more. I think that was it. Overall, you did a very good job. Of the VP of Education. Okay.